What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Junior, here, bringing y'all back with another reaction video. You know what I'm saying? We got Homeless Ben Saves the Life of a 10-year-old. What happened next is shocking. Let's react. All right. Hey, Marquette. Yeah, what's happening? Can I get a loan? Bro, what I look like? A charity? Get you a job, man. Oh, cold. <laughs> hey, my boy, you got better luck getting money in the street with a homeless sign than with Markel over there. Bike is tight. You got that right. Ain't no handouts over here. Uh -uh. Oh, that's the same actor from the other, other other video I was reacting to. Sorry. It's okay. I'm still getting the hang of it. That's a nice car. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Is it remote control? Yeah. That's neat. Thank hey, you. Hey, hey, sir. Back up. I don't want you near him. What do you want? Sorry for the trouble. My name's John. I was wondering if I could use your bathroom. Does this place look like a public restroom to you? Go pee on the street where you belong. Please, sir. I Go! Damn! Get out of here. Damn! Sorry to be of trouble. That's fucked up. That's fucked up, bro. Dad, why didn't you let him use the restroom? He seemed like a nice guy. Because I don't want guys like that in my shop. It's bad for business. Just look at him. But I thought you should never judge someone before you get to know them. There's nothing to know. He's a drug addict. Probably dangerous. And the saying goes, if you feed a stray, it'll keep coming back. We definitely don't want that, right? How else is a stray supposed to get fed? You're missing the point. Just be careful next time, okay? Damn, that's tough. Ah, oh, man. Did I forget to turn the alarm on? Probably. You always do. Yeah. All right, we'll stay right here. I'll be right back. Why would we leave her outside? Wait, wait there, I'll get it. I'll get it. Ah! Ah! There you go. Now, keep a watch out, all right? Thank you. Of course. You know, I have a daughter just a little older than you. Hey, 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 hey. What do you think you're doing, man? I was just trying to help her. Her remote. Stay away from my daughter, you understand me? But, Daddy. Go inside the shop. Bro, is he the no, antagonist no. like in every like in every video dog? I don't know why you think it's okay to talk to my kid. Sir, it's not what you think. I promise you. Just I get out of here if I decide to stop being nice. Okay. Okay. Hey. Hey! Get up, man! Bro, what is this? Bro, take your daughter to work day? Some shit like that, bro? What the fuck is going on? Get up. Oh, now you kicking the nigga. That's crazy. I don't have anything. What? That's crazy. Sorry, sir. I was just trying to... Stay trying to make my barbershop into a homeless encampment? No, that's not the case. That's not happening. Where you... Sir, that's all my stuff. Sir, those are my personal possessions. No. You should have thought about that before you decided to loiter in front of my property. I'm sorry, sir. You think I got to where I am in life by letting homeless people sleep in front of my barber shop? No, sir, I don't. I, I don't, sir. I... What are you doing? Dad, stop it! No, Zuri! <laughs> That's my stuff! Now get your things from the street where you belong. Yes, yeah, sir. Right away, sir. Now I'm gonna call the police for trespassing. No, 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 no police. No police, please, sir. Do not call the police. Yes, 911, I have an emergency. I'll get my stuff, I'll put in a bag. I'll yes. disappear from yeah, this. I'm at my barber shop and there's this homeless man trespassing. There's no jail. I cannot go to jail. And my daughter's just scared for her life. Yes. 
It's fucked up. Oh, now you gonna cap? Yes, please. Send an ambulance right now. I put color mm. in everything I do. Let me show you how easy it is to get. Where am I? Thank God you're okay. You're in the hospital, John. Uh, hospital. Your daughter, is she okay? Yes, yeah, she's okay. Come here, babe. She's all right, thanks to you. Thank you so much for everything. Of course, little one, of course. I can't believe you're still worried about her instead of yourself. Listen, um... I'm really sorry about how I treated you. You have to understand that homeless people aren't as nice as you. And I was just trying to protect my daughter. Yeah, I know. And I've met my, my fair share of homeless people. I also know what it's like to be a protective father. You do? Oh, yeah. I wasn't always like this. You see, just a few years ago, life seemed perfect. I was married with a decent job, and my daughter, Shayla, is my whole world. In the beginning of our marriage, my wife was an up-and-coming realtor. Eventually, she became a lot more successful and oh shit boy getting to her <laughs> ain't gonna lie bro i, I will i will feel some type of way if my girl one pull day. out her, if i'm pulling one since she's pulling out hundos though i ain't gonna lie bro i will feel some type of way too okay oh, bro oh, she was at my home. girl pulling out hundos and i'm pulling out ones bro nah bro that, that shit ain't right bro i came to pay her a visit and let's just say her rich client that she'd always spent a lot of time with was more than just a client. Oh, so she was a sugar Instead mama, bro. feeling any remorse whatsoever, she decided to abandon our family. She went to live a new life with that man she'd been seeing, leaving me and Shayla behind. I did my best to keep everything afloat, but I was so depressed. A lot of days I, I couldn't even get out of bed. So I lost my job. And not long after that, our home. With nowhere to go, I ended up on the street. And it didn't take long for Child Protective Services to come and take my little girl away from me. That had to be the hardest day of my life. So you see, in a very short amount of time, I lost everything. I lost my wife. I lost my job. I lost my home. I even lost my daughter. I did not plan for my life to go this way. But life made other plans. Gosh, I can't believe that happened to you. In all this time, how come you didn't get a new job or try to get your daughter back? New job? Think I didn't try? I went down a downward spiral. I could never dig myself out. When you're homeless, 
people take one look at you and think they know everything there is to know about you. Yeah, well, I guess I'm guilty of that too. I realize now Wazir was trying to tell me that you really shouldn't judge someone before you get to know them. I'm so sorry about that. And I should know better. Because I'm, my wife isn't in the picture anymore either. I'm sorry to hear that. And, and being a single father, a lot of people look at you different. Yeah, they do. At least you still got your daughter there. Uh, I do anything, anything to get my Shayla back. <laughs> Shayla. Who am I kidding? I can't even get a job. You know what? I think I might be able to help with that. Sorry, John. Oh, that's quite all right, little one. Let me get that for you. Let me hear you go. Oh, my dog, fresh, now. Yeah. My what dog. I'll tell you about that remote control car. My dog, fresh. Okay. Here's your paycheck. Wow. Thank you, Mark Hill. Yeah. You know, now that I have an apartment, a few more of these, I could probably get a car. <laughs> and then maybe, God willing. And then? Maybe next year I could uh, try to get Shayla back. Who says you have to wait a whole nother year? Well, I made a bunch of phone calls, pulled a few strings, and... Shayla! Oh, my goodness! How is this possible? <laughs> oh. W fucking mans, bro. W fucking mans, I bro. I never see you again. You think I would let that happen? I've missed you so much. Come here, come here. Oh, goodness, goodness. Oh, you must be... Oh, Janice. Her mom. Well, foster mom. But I like to call her mom. Janice is so nice to me. Oh, that's so good to hear. Thank you. Thank you for taking care of my Shayla. I'm John. I know. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Shayla talks about you all the time. She really loves you. I love her, too. <laughs> I, uh, I don't want to spoil your moment, but does this mean that my days with my sweet girl are limited? Oh, why? Well, I, I don't know how the social service stuff works, but, uh, I mean, I hope you could still be a part of her life, of, of our lives. I'd like that very much. Hi. Andre. W man. Look, it's a stray puppy. I'll take care of it. No, 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 wait, hold on. Uh, let me see if I can find some food around here. I thought you said you shouldn't never feed a stray. Well, that was the old me. And how else is it supposed to get fed, huh? All right, well, I'll be right back. Don't let that cute little puppy leave. Oh. W fucking mans, bro. W fucking mans, bro. That's crazy, bro. W fucking mans, bro. That was a beautiful video right there, bro. That was fucking beautiful, guys. You know what I'm saying? If you guys enjoy that shit, make sure I leave a like, comment, subscribe to your boy, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm out, bro. Peace. Love y'all.